we are playing F sharp horns, which are three meters, 43 centimeters. If you prolong them, it becomes F, it goes down in pitch, and if it's shorter, it goes up. When most folks in the Lone Star State say Longhorn, the sprawling ranch might come to mind, or maybe even the University of Texas. But at the Swiss Club of Dallas, their Longhorns play a very different kind of fight song. There is traditional Alpon music. There is new music they're doing now, but uh, the traditional is more melancholic. They're called the Swiss Longhorns, an Arlington-based group consisting of Chuck Heald, Kurt Furrer, Rudy Berner, and Max Fry. Four guys who get together to play, well, we weren't really sure what they were playing. <laughs> Alpen horn? Yes. What is that thing? It was the handy of the 16th century. In Switzerland, one third is totally mountainous. They have cattle in the valleys. So obviously there was two, three hour walk maybe from the valley farm. So they found out that if they would hollow out a tree and blow in it, that it would make a, a, a sound which would carry up to maybe four or five miles on a good day. And so they would uh, kind of use it uh, to send signal. Then it evolutionized into a standardized instrument. Rudy can tell you how, how he gets his notes. Everything you do is with the, uh, the vibration of the webs. We got uh, a range of 16 notes on the outboard. And the way you warm up your lips before we practice, you have to have a kissing session with your wife for 15 minutes. <laughs> That's what it's really all about. That's what That's, it is. Uh, <laughs> never mind the music. <laughs> the Swiss Longhorns have played Alp horn music all over the world, from birthday parties to festivals. But their most unexpected audience was a giant purple dinosaur. Were even, you even performed with a dinosaur, I heard. Right. And they had a story on Switzerland, you see. Right. Like Barney went to Switzerland and he lost something and then he found it again. You're getting to show this part of the Swiss culture yes. to some young people. Right. With each performance, the Swiss Longhorns introduce a new audience to an old style of music. And with each note, Max, Kurt, Rudy, and Chuck play a bit of their culture. Why do you do this? Well, it's fun. It's something Swiss that uh, you contribute to keeping a custom alive. 